New tonight, holiday residents have turned in a petition asking city council members not to add a high density housing project to their city. News for Utah's Jen Jacobson spoke with one of the group's leaders who says their message to city council is loud and clear. You can't find a place to park your car. Right. Holiday City residents opposing a high rise, high density housing project are making their point clear. It's time to vote Holiday on the Cottonwood Mall development. In May, City Council approved a mixed use city center at the old Cottonwood Mall, prompting Brett Stolton to take action. We want to see responsible and careful development. And what we really want is to see a plan that comes forward that provides an enduring economic and community benefit now and 50 years from now. Stolton says the project would drastically change the city, so he helped launch Unite for Holiday to repeal the city ordinance. Unite for Holiday needed 6,000 signatures, but they gathered nearly 8,000. For the past 45 days, more than 100 volunteers have been going out, knocking doors day and night with this Herculean task of getting 35% of the voter count from the last presidential election from voters here in Holiday. Stolton says there are three main concerns with the project. It may increase the city population by 10%. It requires $22 million in tax increment financing. And the community benefit analysis shows a low return. When you kind of look at the dollars and cents and then the impact to the community and what that means, people are saying, whoa, we're not sure that's thoughtful and careful development. Stolton says it's now up to the city council members to factor these signatures into their decision and put this option on the November ballot. In Holiday, Jen Jacobson, News for Utah. We reached out to the Holiday City Council to see if they've considered putting this measure on the November ballot. We have not heard back.